guys welcome to our channel in this video we are going to go through a very interesting topic the psychology of trading so most people when they start off trading the forex market they first start off by learning how to analyze the markets and how to go about trading and after that they think that they are set up for life so they start trading in fact we also fell for the same trap in fact when we started we learned technical analysis i think for around a month or two then we started live trading and fortunately we were able to flip an account from $300 to $1000 but after that we lost it all within two weeks so it was kind of really painful for us but we decided not to give up and we stuck to the game and we are fortunate to get to the point that we are currently such that we can be able to share with you the knowledge that we have so the psychology of trading is what really enables you to to keep your mind in balance when you are trading the markets and to be able to make money consistently and be able to sustain yourself in the forex market. So what do we mean by that? What we mean is that it's normal that when you start trading, when you execute a position and you make money or you win, most of the times that you'll get yourself you're attached to the winners and now you think that you're a god in the markets, you think that you know everything and most people don't even attribute winners to luck in fact they attribute winning to skill and losses to bad luck unfortunately we want to turn that around to you and tell you if it, if you can be able to attribute your winners to luck and then you can be able to attribute your losses to skill that would propagate you in your learning and move you into learning faster and being able to put that mental balance into your mind what you mean by mental balance is when you win you, it's just a win and when you lose it's just a loss so when you lose you don't really feel much pain coming into your heart you don't take the losses to your heart and you don't take the winners to your mind so the psychology of trading basically deals with the study of the mind and the behavior of humans while making decisions in the forex market or any other market actually any other financial market in trading so in the psychology of trading you get to go through some of the biases that people go through while they are trading the forex market and any other market some of the common mistakes that people make like thinking that the markets are not random while practically markets are random and you get to get how emotions are bad while you are trading the forex market and why fear greed ego regret such things are not really good in forex trading so i think just like Caleb was saying in Caleb has been saying this in other videos know thyself and know thy enemy and in a hundred battles you'll always win so I'll change that and mine will be if you don't know yourself then the stock market is an expensive place to find out because if you're a person who's impulsive then I think you need to find a way in which you'll be dealing with that impulse when it comes to trading because when you make a loss generally if you're impulsive you'll tend to want to revenge and to make money immediately so that's really bad in trading because that won't work you should trade out of opportunity not out of a need to make money that's so those are some of the things that you get to learn once you start trading so i think sitting down and sitting down with yourself familiar, familiarizing yourself with who you really are going down deeper into seeking who you really are is really helpful and is an age that most people have actually not taken seriously in the markets Again, if you look into spirituality, you discover that if you can be able to combine spirituality and trading, I think you can be able to go to the next level of trading because you're bringing consciousness, you're bringing intuition, and you're bringing such things into the market which are really helpful. With spirituality, what you mean is by, uh, basically, according to my belief, is someone who's spiritual is also someone who's matured. Um, his, the mind is matured and mentally, I think he's on another level. So I think if you're on another level and you bring that into forex trading, then you're going to get to the other level in consciousness and in such things. So we get to go deeper with such things in our course and how you can be able to integrate such things. But for now, I was only introducing you to what psychology of trading is and how you need to also familiarize yourself before you really jump into making money in the markets and especially making money and surviving in the markets. The idea that making a thousand dollars or making three hundred dollars within a month or two in the forex market is really being successful is not really success according to what you think success in the markets is lasting for a long time and for this long time being able to make money consistently simply 
you are able to make money year in year out so it means you have been able to hack not only the system of trading but you're also able to hack the psychology of trading and you're able to understand the markets in a broad way such that you're able to be flexible when the facts change and you're also not holding into your opinions when you shouldn't be holding into your opinions the markets will only act as a mirror reflecting what's inside of us so if what's inside of you is not what is required for you to attain success in the markets then the ultimate answer is not going to the markets but going inside of you and trying to hack yourself and trying to see the best way that you can be able to survive and last in the markets so trading also it deals a lot to the mind and in the head job concept we talk about mind money and method so you need to integrate the three and come up with the best way that you can be able to trade tackling all the three topics so that's all from our side you need to go down do your research on psychology of trading go deeper and find the right answers so that you can start trading and last in trading that's all and have a nice week